Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a room tour. It's a super highly requested one on my Instagram. So I'm excited to show you guys around my entire room, every single item that I have inside this little tiny box. Uh, my room isn't the biggest room, but it's definitely my favorite room and I'm so happy with the way I decorated it. Um, everything that I have in my room, um, I'm going to link it in the description below. So if you see something that you like or that you want in your room, then you can go ahead and find the link in my description. Anyway, starting off, first of all, we have here my mirror. So I got this mirror from Walmart for $50. It's like almost my height. I'm like, how tall am I? 5'10", right? I'm like 5'10", so I think it's like 50 to 70 um, inches. Uh, and yeah, and then right next to it, I have this little stool over here that used to be my nightstand until I replaced it with my nightstand. And right now, it's just holding on to Hector. If you guys watched my first YouTube video Q&A, you know that it's my baby. All right, moving on. We have the, wait for it. We have the nominal alhamdulillah sign. You guys can use code use of truth. Link in the description if you guys want to support your boy. But anyway, next up. We have the magnificent window. <laughs> uh, there's nothing really special about this window other than like, I think this is super convenient. How it doesn't have the, the drawstrings and stuff. I keep kind of keep my window so empty because I usually keep the window open sometimes because it gets really hot in here because my room is really small. Um, so when I do do that, I don't like anything to be like, if it's windy, I don't like it to be pushing out. This is a candle that my sister got for me for my birthday. Thank you very much. The camera woman in the back. And, <laughs> and then this is my alarm clock, my trusty alarm clock that I rely on for Fajr Salah. But I got this, what is it called? Nightstand? I got this nightstand from Home Goods for like 25 bucks when it was on sale. And it's pretty good. It has like a really nice industrial vibe. And yeah, this is kind of like where, I mean, it's a nightstand. How, how interesting can it get, right? <laughs> and then my lamp. All right, moving on to the masterpiece that everyone absolutely loves about my room. So initial funny story, when I first created this whole thing, I kind of wanted it only to be on the borders of, and the corner of this wall. So when I started doing it, I had to scotch tape and individually tape every single piece uh, onto the wall. So if you, you guys, it's not one big tapestry, it's individual vines that I had to tape to the wall. So, I got that from Amazon also, it's a really good addition. Now, this is probably one of my most favorite paintings, and it's the room, it's the thing that ties this whole backdrop together, painted by my beloved sister also, she does like freelance Arabic, um, what is it called, calligraphy and stuff, so that's really cool. Now, I got some pillows on my bedding, and I love the color green, so it was really hard for me to find a duvet, this color, so I had to a resort to Etsy. I'll try to find a link for uh, a green comforter. If I can't, I'll put something similar to that. I only use two comforters in my room. I use this one and I use a white one. Next up, we have some blankets from Home Goods. And so when I was creating my room, I was kind of going for the more like jungle kind of slash like Jannah vibe, trying to like make everything more naturey and more natural because I know that I have natural light coming in from this window. So I was thinking about like what what rug would look good in this room. So I chose this uh, like jungle straw rug and it's made out of like straw. The only downside to this rug is that it accumulates a lot of dust. And in terms of that, if you're someone who's really sensitive with allergies or who has eczema like me, then I probably advise don't get this rug because it take, I vacuum my room maybe like once a week and that's only after it gets really, really disgusting with like, you know, a lot of dust. But, okay, now, over here, I have my desk, which is doubles into a standing desk. This desk I got from Walmart, it has like these two little latches over here on the side, and if I wanted to, I can pull it out and reattach it to the two sides over here. Later on this year, I got into reading a lot, so these are kind of like my collection of books. Sometimes at nighttime, whenever I do want to, like, kind of, wind down. I come over here, I grab one of my journals or one of my books. But yeah, so then I have all my nominal um, like jewelry and people that send me jewelry. I have this little tiny thing that my uncle gave me. 
Uh, next to it, I have all of my eye colored contacts, and then I have my prescription glasses over here that I don't really use either. Now, on top of it, I have my another plant. Yeah, so I got this little handy plant from at home, and the plant itself, I got it from Home Depot when it was like a little baby, and now it's like all grown up and stuff. And I got this little hanging light that used to be over here um, initially, but then when I got this like bookshelf slash desk area, I needed like a light to use in order for this place to be like illuminated so this little tray over here this tray is super useful because instead of having like a super cluttered desk then i just put everything on there so it's like your boy struggles with eczema so i have like a whole bunch of eczema creams and kind of just like other things that i use like hair product and my colognes my vitamins speaking of vitamins so yeah take your vitamin d people super important and then I have other vitamins in there and like other healthcare stuff that I take every day. Like chocolate extract, um, like ginseng, like green tea or red tea extract for like immune system and stuff. And then I have a lighter over here because at nighttime, whenever I want to get into like a meditative, you know, zen vibe, then I light like a whole bunch of candles. I have a candle there, candle here, like three candles underneath my bed that I keep. Uh, I light them all up and then I kind of just get into the mood of everything, right? Now, over here, I have some more jewelry just kind of like laying around. Uh, these are kind of like my everyday things, usually this entire area. Right now it's clean because I'm filming a room tour, but on a normal daily basis, there's like the whole combobulation of just disgusting stuff in here, right? Next to that, I have my... Ring light, which I don't really use as a ring light. I morally just use it because how tiny it is. It looks so puny. <laughs> My sister's laughing behind the camera. <laughs> it's so small, so I only use it. I literally use it only as a like a light source, or I just use it as like a, a thing for light. I don't even use that because that's like disgusting small dim light. Over here, I have um, what is it called, Budgie? Uh, a calendar. A calendar. <laughs> So you guys know that January is the month that we're in. <laughs> so we're in no, January. it's not. We're in January 2021. Uh, and yeah, that's, that's, what we have. that's it. That's it. And we have a trash can. That's it, right? So my uncle gave me like a $30 gift card to Target. And I didn't really know what to buy with it. So I was like, why not just spend it all on, on gum? On this wall over here, I have my closet and have like this little coat hanger, which you guys might be wondering, like Yusuf, why the heck do you have a coat hanger all the way on the top over there? Well, that's a very good question for those of you wondering. This over here is for Kufis. If you guys know I'm like a Muslim, if you don't know, then I am Muslim. Uh, so right now I don't have any because I decided to put them in my closet because it kind of destroys the color scheme of things. Um, but yeah, usually I have my thing over there. I have my camera bag on this doorknob, my school bag on this doorknob, and over here I have you know, like my closet. I'll probably like dedicate a whole other video to my closet because there's way too much going on in there. And then I have a whole bunch of Disney collectibles. That's a whole other story. <laughs> it's a whole other story. But yeah. Um... When I think about that, I literally feel like we were kids scouring the attic well, and then found like a jackpot of treasure. In a nutshell, that's what happened, but I'm gonna give a whole story. Maybe we can do like a story time together, like you and I. But okay, <laughs> I guess that's all for my room. I guess there's nothing really much more to say. Um, everything that was in this room is going to be linked down below. Literally every single thing, like from the books to like the small details, all of, all, all of the links are gonna be in the description below. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new, turn on your post notifications, uh, and I'll see you guys in the next video.